Okay, so now that we've downloaded the latest version of Houdini, let's uh, take a look at getting it installed because I just want to make sure that we are all installing the same thing. And so I just want to walk through uh, the process of, of installing Houdini and the Houdini engine just so everyone can see me do it. All right, so we're all on the same page. All right, so let's take a look at that. All right, so here is the latest uh, installation of Houdini, the one I just downloaded. So I'm going to double click on this here. And what I want to do is wait for the pop-up to happen. It's going to ask me a few questions and I'll uh, gladly provide some answers. All right, so I'm just waiting for the pop-up to happen here. Okay, so I do want to allow this device to make some changes. And we're going to start the launcher here. And this is where we have a bunch of options where we can decide where Houdini goes, what we install, those kinds of things. So I'm going to go hit next and we're going to agree to the license agreement. All right. And now we're going to choose a certain amount of components here. All right. So we want the main application, all the file associations. We definitely want to make sure that we're on commercial license. Okay. Because again, this does not work in apprentice. Okay. So I just want to make that very clear. And then I do want to uh, include a desktop icon for this. It'll just make it easier. Okay, so I'm going to hit next. And I do want to install the Houdini engine for Unity. So I'm going to check that. And I'm going to hit next again. And I'm going to set up. And I'm just going to install it to the default location. You're more than welcome to install it wherever you would like. But I'm going to keep it at default like that. And I'm going to hit next. And that's going to be our start menu folder, which is great. And then I'm going to uninstall the previous version of Houdini. Okay, so my previous version was 165. So let's install and let this roll. So I'll be right back once this is finished. All right, so there we go. We have it installed. Okay, so I have 17.5.170. This might change throughout the recording of the this entire course, but this is what we're starting with. Um, and it should be uh, relatively stable for you. Of course, we might just update a few point numbers there. All right, so uh, now that I have it installed, let's get moving on and start learning about tops and getting our environment variables set up. And we also need to get Unity all ready to go. Okay, thanks so much.